What's up guys, this is The Rifleman and I am back bringing you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play as France. So to kind of round off about last time, uh, pretty much I fought, I pushed back an Ottoman stack that was moving on Cairo and the other big annoying thing is the Mughal Empire have captured uh, Dutch Guiana. But that's okay because ultimately I will take it back with this army in Trinidad and Tobago and I'm going to start ferrying artillery from Jamaica. And to be honest, I need, a, I need a stronger navy because what I'd like to do is fortify all of these and put a garrisons in there. But I don't have the tr I don't have the money. Whereas if I had a navy, I could have destroyed this very, very easily. So if I go to here, bring in a fifth, and I can recruit fourths. But I am starting to. I am going to have have a university dedicated to advancing my naval research to get and get so I can get strong navies. Because look, it looks like a big scary British stack, but actually it's full of junk. Spanish missionary. Well, we're definitely going to... Right, 31% chance. So one of these guys should kill him. There's a... No, oh, come on, one of these should get him. Got him. Good. That's what happens when you steal my tech. Good. <clears throat> can I my main 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 main? Can I attack you yet? I can because you'll be angry, you'll riot, and then you'll be fine. But you won't rebel crucially. And please grow, grow Brunswick, our oh, Eastport. I want Eastport to grow first. Once this army is ready, uh, replenished, they will move out. And attack John Churchill, hopefully drawing in the reinforcements from this fac uh, stack on a Chadwick Manton with the Worcester Regiment and Rogers Rangers. Maybe followed up by the Iroquois, because this is their last territory if I knock them out. This area is secured. And these guys just need money to replenish, but I keep spending it elsewhere. Ah, I know what I might build here. Church school. All these are going to be, most of these anyway, are going to be um, Protestants. Well, actually, I could just do that, start doing that now. How old is this priest? 48. Well, <clears throat> it should be okay for a while then. Um, yeah, I'm going to need to start converting all these to Catholicism. Wait a minute. Ah, Louisiana. Good old Louisiana. Doing it for me. See, so Sweden's there. Don't want to fight Sweden, really. But I think I'm going to have to eventually. Because I want that territory. Yes, I will do this. Boom. Victoire! <laughs> Back you go. It seems a bit of a waste having that army in Brandenburg. It's it much too, well. What I need to do actually is check what level forts it is. If it's level two, well, I think it's level two. Disassemble them, build up to level one again. Then pull that army out and deploy it somewhere else where I want to conquer territory. I don't want to expand in Europe anymore. That's fine now. Where, where I'm at, I'm happy with. But I do need to prepare for if a colonial power decides they want to attack me. It's just Sweden, Louisiana. Yeah, they're going after the other region, which is fine. There is a port in this region. Another raid. Has not yet been developed. Uh, infiltrate Dresden. Let's keep an eye on our. Keep an eye on our. Uh, workers on strike in Maine. You'll be alright. Okay, so ports. Tactically, where do I want to build my port? Hmm. 
Choose I've got, I've got a reasonable amount of money to do lots of different things. I think first, replenish you and recruit two more units of artillery. That's what we want to do. Maybe get two units of line. Right, to so start some of these. This, they might not be the most cost-efficient places to spend money, but there are areas that will it will still provide me with benefit in future turns. Cairo needs well, yeah, another layer, another entire layer of expanding. Do Dam over there still exists? Let's put a bit more. Money into replenishing you, and let's ship out two units of line. Yep, they can do it. And then Berlin, I don't have the money because I've spent it all. Nope, level one, perfect. In which case, this then this army is going to be replenished, and then I'm going to ship it somewhere else. I'm not sure where. Maybe down to uh, down to here to conquer these back, and I can actually leave these to carry on their job of securing the Caribbean. Now I've got an attack on the Windward Islands. Move, move, move. Embark. Ah, oh, I've not even got my. <clears throat> not even got all my army. My navy, sorry. Let's fight that. Capture the Windward Islands. Yeah, take the Windward Islands behind. And as this army expands, they will end up being a. Well, they'll be like a uh, high response unit that's going to sit in the Bahamas, and when the next time they're high readiness amphibious assault, things like that. Unit out here as well. Single hit. Again, it's kind of the point of these. There you go. He's got his telescope out. He's looking at. Sorry, guys, didn't have time to mute my microphone then. That was a bit quick. Uh... General's bodyguards being a bit silly. Gendarmerie over here. Because they will be being shot at by my line infantry. And hopefully I can snipe their general. Ah, oh, no. Hit the Union Dragoons. That's just going to be. I'm not charging. Militia, 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 pikes. There you go, they will get engaged by this unit of uh, Hessian line infantry. Ah, oh, poor Jagoons.
Get to view, focus fire. You don't focus fire anyone because they're all militia, just shoot them all evenly. Is that all your cavalry? It is all your cavalry, except for your general. Alright, the dragoons are back. Oh, them just got knocked off there. Oh, God! Gonna charge me in of infantry. It's a bad idea, don't do it! Oh, they're wasting your dragoons! You might actually want to shoot. Canister. This militia unit could be about to be engaged in hand to hand combat with pikes. Not a good idea. Reload like your lives depend on it, because they do! You should be engaging them. You are engaging them. Good. Well, if all you want to do is just attack in that direction, then I'm going to do this. Really mess with your head. There we go. Stole a march on you. This is what you get, citizens of the Windward Islands, when you withstand against the French Empire. Oh, hello. African musketeers. Imprisoned, bittered, slaves. Ah, I lost my general, but actually it's my... Uh... Ah, they must have got hit by an artillery... By, um... Artillery shell. Shot. Thing. Oh, look at them not having fire by rank. Isn't it cute? And no bayonets either. I suppose they've been going high on the uh, navy techs. Go for the guns. Trying to intercede. No, they're not. They're just running around. Into the breach, gotcha. Oh, 
Oh, look at that. This is just tragic. I've not got the firepower to take advantage of it, sadly. Pike's coming back in again. Where are you? Okay. Go into that unit, I suppose. I'm running away from, I'm running around from around their uh, defenses. So. Ah, the Pikes did make it in. There we go, once they've got solid infantry in there, they shouldn't be as... Let's get all my artillery to just keep pecking at their general's bodyguard. Could send everyone to just charge. Let's speed this up a bit, actually. Choppity chop, with Chopperton of Chop Town. Ah! The whole line, get in this and turn off artillery. Well, oh, the general charged in, hated it, and ran off. Yeah, I'd be shaken too, considering you know what's going to happen. There you go, let's end it. Because I'm attacking a city, doesn't matter. Sweet. Another sugar plantation. Cool. But I've got no money. Cool. So let's hit. Is that an another raking? No. Good. Whew. Right. Let's hit end turn. Oh, the British are forming up an army to try and oppose me. Well, if you want to walk straight down to, straight to the muzzle of my guns, then much obliged. Defense of a town. Well, this is Boston, isn't it? In a way, it's quite beneficial. Because it means I can still benefit from my smaller numbers. Well, from my depleted units, individual units. Just a minute, let me shut that window, that's super annoying. Uh, 
And I'm back. Showing the window didn't help because it's not a very good window. <laughs> so that's what I've got left. Let's keep my cavalry wide on the left flank as it's open. Let's put you here to exploit any gaps if they don't deploy on the left. And then let's put you maybe here to run up and garrison this warehouse. Then we artillery. Hmm. Maybe well, not my single cannon might be useful. Yeah. Where do I want to put it? Put it out. God damn it. Choices, choices, choices. Let's put the artillery out here. And then, Mon General. So you run up and garrison that house. You garrison the town hall. So I have the cav advantage, so let's threaten you. Oh no, where are they aiming? We're not aiming for the warehouse. You monsters! Good. Hit the native Bowman Auxiliary because they've been foolish enough to come right in front of me. Cavalry's charging in. I'm not even going to go into line square for that. Fine, I'll run my general in. Native Warrior Auxiliary moving in, being fired upon. You steamboat straight into this quest into this gap. Not 
not that the artillery is even firing yet. But the pike seem to be a bit broken, so... Leg it, gun it before the back to the own lines. No, look, don't don't run into the pike combat. Run away from the pike combat. You're on a big four-legged animal. go the fragments are going to start to move in I see you native musketman auxiliary reforming in the trees They really want to kill my cavalry. Oh, they took an artillery shot straight through my cavalry. That was going to happen. Pull down their, pull down their troops off of their horses. Keep my, see my general stood still. Pikes are losing slightly, but they might gain the advantage. That's why I need to smash into them with the cavalry and hope my morale gets them, gets them down. See they're shaken, wavering. Uh, 
There we go. Chase them down. Hello, they're attaching plug bayonets. Okay, so let's get you and you. Get into this fight as well. Regiment of regiment of foot of pikemen has been destroyed. Okay, now you chase down that union of line. My general, you chase into them. By the time, by the time uh, my guys have had their way with them. There you go. So you chase that unit. You chase that unit. Continue, because this is a raiding British army. And these guys are tired, my guys are winded, so you might actually be able to... It's quite a lot of troops there, really. Oh, these British haven't escaped past the farmhouse. Oh, the last three... Oh, God, it's like the am um, watching... Uh, the Patriot. Oh. <laughs> Alright, okay. There you go, all cavalry focusing on these 20 dudes. Let's speed this up a bit. 10, 4, 2, 1. <laughs> Damn, I missed him. Got him. There we go, perfect. Raining British force pushed back to their continent. Push back to their uh, their region. The Austrians are still giving it giving it a go with the Prussians, so that's handy, very handy for me. Ah, oh, the Russia. Don't be a little scamp, Russia. Hmm. Rioting has broken out in this region as the lower orders have become too. Up yeah, but I bet you're happy now. Yeah, you are. You broke your town hall. Okay, so priority is. Oh, it's a privateer and frustrating, I bet. Because the British Navy is here, I'd have to respond in kind. In which case, then... Hmm. Diplomacy, Russia, open, request peace. Open, request peace, and tech. How about that and that? Give them a bunch of tech to make peace. Worth doing, because I was making no money, and now I have my money, I can start building on a building up a navy. Because if that happens again, I'll be screwed if I've not got a navy that can defeat 
both of these. While, they've, while they are small, they're mostly fifths and sixths and some odd captured bits and pieces, I need to be able to... I need to be able to defeat them, otherwise I'm going to be in major trouble. Repair that. Repair that. Can't build roads, but nevertheless, that's okay. Cool. Anyway, looking at the time, I think that's the end of this part. So, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.